We have really uh, annihilated them. We have followed them from the areas of Tokomeka, the areas in Nituri, areas of Chabi, Boga. I told you at the beginning that we have a lot of weapons that have also been recovered by the FRDs, our counterparts in Operation Shuja. But as of what we have on the Ugandan side is a total of 142 pieces of AK-47 or the SMG, eight pieces of uh, PKM, the multipurpose machine gun. Then we have three pieces of RPG, one piece of 60mm uh, mortar, over 8,000 rounds. And I will assure you, when I'm talking of 8,000 rounds, that should be double or triple because some of the ammunition, to avoid carrying, our soldiers end up using them. I mean, why should we bring them back? But uh, we have more than 8,000. Recovered almost for PK, not less than 1,500. Charger ports, walk talkies, ETCTC, with over 31 defectors. Defectors meaning those who have come out from the ADF ranks and reported to us. Children abductees uh, re rescued, over 156. We have always been handing them over here, bringing them out and take them to another, another stage where we always keep those who work and be rehabilitated and begin teaching them about the, the hands-on, to use their hands, basically. That's it. Uh, others, anemia, they come in, we have just delivered. Of course, you know, in the bush there, they always have poor obstetric care. This means delivery is a problem. Actually, I received two mothers. One is gravid right now. One delivered, they lost the baby had a premature delivery at around seven months old and uh, right now we are caring for her though she's still weak she lost a lot of blood we transfused her and she's okay she's good she's now okay out of danger right currently